hey guys, I've been able to generate over $3,000 of sales with an ROI of over 4,600% using just SMS marketing automation. So guys, in this video, we'll be discussing about how you can set up your SMS marketing automation flows and I will teach you everything in depth, in detail, step by step. So without further ado, let's start the video. So guys, first install the SMS bump app and you will be welcomed by this screen. And the first step would be to go to the view guide and complete all the compliances. Completing all these compliances is very important as if you don't complete these compliances, this would be against the legal regulations. So this is the full guide and it's very easy to understand and the SMS bump staff is, has put all the screenshots together in this guide and you can easily follow along and complete all the steps which I mentioned here. I have also uh, placed a summary of all the guide in the SMS marketing guidebook which I will be putting the link in the description. Ok guys so now I will give you a quick follow up of how to perform all the steps mentioned in the guide. Go to your Shopify store, go to settings, go to checkout and scroll to the bottom and here you will find email marketing. Make sure you select show a sign up option at checkout and make sure you keep this option unchecked as it's against the regulations all right next when you scroll down here are manage checkout languages click on that and then uh, here search for checkout marketing okay in the checkout marketing here accept marketing material paste this thing that's mentioned in the guide and then in checkout and system checkout shop policies paste this in under the privacy policy button okay so these steps are mentioned here okay so now go back to the checkout tab go to settings checkout and here uh, make sure that it is optional shipping address phone number then scroll to the bottom again go to the manage checkout languages and search for phone label in phone label you have to paste this text phone number for updates and exclusive offers in both the tabs phone label and optional phone label then click on save go to the settings legal and in the privacy policy it's your choice either you can use your own privacy policy or you can use the shopify template whatever you do after that just copy this text text marketing notifications and make sure you replace the company name with your company name then click on save then go to the online store theme actions edit languages <coughs> search for checkout shop policies and here under privacy policy tab just paste this text and here also make sure that the company name has been changed by you and also if you have other options like continue to shipping if you want to change it to something else you can change it it's up to you then finally the last step would be that go in the settings of sms bump and scroll down to the quiet hours and make sure it is enabled and your time zone should be of that country from which majority of your orders come from. So for me, US and Canada is the primary time zone. So I've selected that time zone and then in the quiet hours, you can choose the time. So from 9 p.m. to 9 a.m. is the recommended time by SMS bound. So we should go with that. So once you finish the setup, your checkout page should look something like this. Here, there is a sign up for exclusive offers and news via text, messages and email. And phone number for updates and exclusive offers and at the bottom here is the text which we added. So guys now we'll be setting up the automations. With these automations only I've been able to generate over $3,000 of sales and over 4,000% of return of investment. Let's check how to do these automations. Uh, to do the automations first visit the automations tab in SMS bump. Here there are multiple automations already enabled. So now uh, first we'll be doing the first automation which is the abandoned cart automation. In this we'll click on edit. And then here is 30 minutes delay, we'll do a one hour delay. Guys, I would recommend doing the exact same settings which I'm doing. One hour. So this is all ready. Just keep it simple and it works. And save. And then turn it on. And guys, remember that you have to also add the SMS bump balance. Otherwise, these automations won't work. Then abandoned cut reminder, one day delay. And then in the second message, add a discount code for 10% off. So this is also done. This is a one day delay. Make sure it is one day and that's it. Save. 
then turn it on then guys we'll need to duplicate one of the uh, messages so clone this will be abandoned cart after three days save now i did this here time is three days last chance here first name an item in your cart is almost over. get 15 percent discount on your whole order then discount percentage 15 add discount code and then also use the abandoned cart url then also add shop at checkout so yeah that's it so save now switch it on now the next automation is the product upsell so we can edit this product cross sell one so product upsell so here we can select the products now select your products and you don't want to repeat the product recommendations delay is for one hour increase the discount in this you can increase it to whatever you can say 25 percent off percentage 25 and discount code at shop that's it product upsell and this is after one hour then click on save and switch it on then clone it product upsell after one day so edit it the delay should be enabled one hour it's now one day here to really show our appreciation for your support we have upgraded our coupon code from uh, the earlier was 25% off to 35% off get it here Thirty five percentage and save. Now switch this on. So, guys, this was a short tutorial on how you can automate your SMS marketing sequences and convert more customers for your Shopify store. So, guys, you can follow the same strategy, same tricks, and the same techniques. You can follow the guide which I provided, and there are other automation sequences and the templates you use as well. I'll put the link to that guide in the description. So thank you guys. This was it for this video and I'll meet you again with some new content and new tutorials soon and shortly. Guys do share the video, do subscribe the channel and do comment down below if you have any doubts or if you like the video. Guys your support matters a lot. Thank you. Goodbye. Much love. Peace.